Hello again, welcome to today's attempt at the spottle puzzle. This is Wordle, but there are some obstructions in the grid. That's what those black cells are. We won't get any information about the letters that we put in those positions. So I might as well use the M and the U, slightly less common letters in those positions. It doesn't matter as long as it still makes a word. Really, I'm trying to find out about the A, S and E, because those are the three most common letters. And we've got an S, but you can see the M and the U, they might be in the word, they might not be. We just don't know. But getting one letter correct straight away, that's not a bad start, is it? Now, I don't have to use that S on my next guess because I'm not on hard mode, and I don't think I'm going to. Let's just try I, N, T, and R. Those are all pretty decent letters. Oh, we've only got the I, okay. So what's that last letter going to be? Is it going to be something like swish with an SH ending? Even an ISH ending is now a possibility. I'm not quite willing to try that just yet. Could be whisk though. So actually maybe I should try hawks because then I'll know if it is whisk or something similar. Oh, we've not got a K so that makes swish very likely, doesn't it? Is there anything else it can be? I'm not sure there is, you know, I'm going to have to go for it. I usually would spend an extra guess or two making absolutely certain that I know all the letters. Because if this is wrong, I'm basically wasting a guess because I'm not going to learn anything useful. But I'm fairly confident this must be correct. And it is. So that is Spotlight 4, one of my better ones. You can see I quite often get it in 6. Um, so to get it in 2 fewer guesses than that, pretty happy with that. And we extend the streak to three. Not the biggest of streaks, because this is quite a difficult game. Let me know how you got on. Thank you for watching, and bye for now.